bulletproof vests as fashion statements. But as David Winter shows us, not everyone sees tactical as practical. Inside Exclusive, an urban clothing store in Cincinnati's Short Vine, hanging alongside torn jeans and colorful kicks, you'll find these fashion tactical gear. There's really no boundaries or no holes, boy, when it comes to fashion, so it was like, okay, this is what they want, so let me go ahead and give it to them. The trend emerged in the early 2000s when rapper 50 Cent wore one. It reemerged in the spring. This YouTube video shows Meek Mill at the NBA All-Star Game. And while it's still to be seen how quickly these are going to be flying off the shelves, even the store management is a little unsure how it feels about selling them. I was against getting them, but it was like the demand became so high for them, it really forced my hand to go ahead and, and order and pick the, pick the item up because, I mean, that's what I'm here for. Like, I, I had to supply the demand of the fashion. Davis is not alone. Enter fake bulletproof vests on Amazon and you'll find them all over, ranging from $50 to about $150. Even Louis Vuitton sells one. None actually provide protection. It's all about the look. I was going to get a yellow one with some all white forces. You know what I mean? Yellow vest with the white forces. Go get me some little rock star pants or something. Feel me? Mess it up like that with it. Xavier Bolden thought of picking one up. We caught up with him at City Heights Market, where the manager says he's not too thrilled with the fashion statement. When you see a kid walking in with, with this on, what are you thinking? I'll have, I'll, I'll be worried. Why? You know? Like, uh, I'd rather not to see that. And Zavian says he decided against it as well, saying he would choose function over fashion. If I'm aware of it, I'm going to make sure it's going to protect me. I ain't going to wear it for the style. Back at Exclusive, the trend has died down. While they're glad in some ways, they say it would be nice if it got hot again just long enough for them to clear the rack. David Winter, Local 12 News. And we called several schools and police departments in the area, and they say they haven't really seen enough of the vests to make any comment. Let's